but but your first you, you you were doing that for a while but then your first big break in film came with a classic i mean the soundtrack i love the movies yeah, the a, big chill. A classic the big chill right and it happens and, and i got cut out of film but everything i wanted to happen actually did i I it, it established how I would want to work there, uh, with Lawrence Cass, and there was a professionalism, and there was an idea, and I was in that movie, and you know, and and luckily he turned around and cast me in Silverado, and uh, it just was, uh, you know, coming from being a stage manager, taking out trash, and. Suddenly, I was able to do the thing that I wanted to do. Doesn't it give you? I mean, you're, you're you've been a superstar for so many years. Doesn't it give you an ultimate appreciation for what you get to do every day because you had to work your way through? I do. I, I think about it a lot. I, the movies have a hold on people, and even when we go to make movies, wherever we make them, it's always like the circus comes to town, wherever it is in the small towns in America, even overseas, and something always happens that never fails to happen. Two or three people living in those towns, four or five people, seeing those trucks come in at night, the lights, they wonder what's going on. And inevitably, three or four people in that town go, I'm going to go do what these people do. I want to do that. We have crazy hours. You, you, you know, people think they want to do what you do. Nice. Lots <laughs> of luck. It's, it's, there's long hours, but some people are built for it.